coming to the second problem on comparing the ratios a1 by a2 b1 by b2 and c1 by c2 find out whether the lines representing the following pairs of linear equations intersect at a point are parallel or coincident the first set of equations is 5x minus 4y plus 8 is equal to 0 and 7x plus 6y minus 9 is equal to 0 so writing down the first set of equations 5x minus 4y plus 8 is equal to 0 and 7x plus 6y minus 9 is equal to 0 on comparing the given set of equations with the standard equations a1x plus b1y plus c1 is equal to 0 and a2x plus b2y plus c2 is equal to 0 we get a1 is equal to 5 b1 is equal to minus 4 c1 is equal to 8 and a2 is equal to 7 b2 is equal to 6 and c2 is equal to minus 9 so let us find down a1 by a2 which is nothing but 5 by 7 and b1 by b2 is equal to minus 4 divided by 6 which is nothing but minus 2 by 3 c1 by c2 is equal to 8 by minus 9 which is nothing but minus 8 by 9 if we observe the values of a1 by a2 is 5 by 7 and b1 by b2 is minus 2 by 3 and c1 by c2 is minus 8 by 9 none of the values a1 by a2 b1 by b2 and c1 by c2 are equal so a1 by a2 is not equal to b1 by b2 this is also not equal to c1 by c2 by using the first condition if a1 by a2 is not equal to b1 by b2 we conclude that given set of linear equations are intersecting so the given equations are intersecting that means the lines which represent the given equations are intersecting lines coming to the second bit the given set of linear equations are 9x plus 3y plus 12 is equal to 0 this is equation number 1 and 18x plus 6y plus 24 is equal to 0 this is equation number 2 if we compare the given set of linear equations with the standard equations a1x plus b1y plus c1 is equal to 0 and a2x plus b2y plus c2 is equal to 0 we get a1 is equal to 9 b1 is equal to 3 and c1 is equal to 12 and the values of a2 b2 c2 are a2 is 18 b2 is 6 and c2 is 24 so let us find a1 by a2 which is nothing but 9 by 18 9 by 18 is 1 by 2 and b1 by b2 is equal to 3 divided by 6 which is nothing but 1 by 2 and c1 by c2 is equal to 12 divided by 24 which is nothing but 1 by 2 if we observe the values of a1 by a2 and b1 by b2 and c1 by c2 all the three values are equal to 1 by 2 so we can conclude that a1 by a2 is equal to b1 by b2 is equal to c1 by c2 by using the second condition if a1 by b a2 is equal to b1 by b2 is equal to c1 by c2 the given set of equations represent coincident lines now these two equations represent coincident lines now coming to the third bit the given set of linear equations are 6x minus 3y plus 10 is equal to 0 and 2x minus y plus 9 is equal to 0 if we compare the given set of equations with 
the standard equations a1x plus b1y plus c1 is equal to 0 and a2x plus b2y plus c2 is equal to 0. We get a1 is equal to 6, b1 is equal to minus 3 and c1 is equal to 10. Similarly, a2 is equal to 2 and b2 is equal to minus 1 and c2 is equal to 9. So, a1 by a2 is equal to 6 divided by 2 which is nothing but 3. In the similar manner, b1 by b2 is equal to minus 3 divided by minus 1 which is nothing but 3. And c1 divided by c2 is equal to 10 divided by 9. If we observe, the values of a1 by a2 and b1 by b2 are equal to 3. So, a1 by a2 is equal to b1 by b2 is equal to 3 this is not equal to c1 by c2. From the third condition, a1 by a2 is equal to b1 by b2 which is not equal to c1 by c2, we can conclude that the given set of linear equations represent parallel lines.